Over the past month, I've been helping a few students learn Why Georgia by John Mayer. I've just been kind of piecing it together from different tabs and videos, and it's not an easy one to learn, and there's not like a singular tab or resource that I found is like totally got it. So here's what we have so far. Uh, and hopefully I can make it easier for other people to try and learn this. So you go. Next part's gonna look like this. I'm gonna explain. So it's pretty hard. Going fast is even tougher. You really kind of gotta get in a flow. I don't use this technique, so this is hard for me learning to slap my thumb. So what you gotta do is first you gotta put your third finger on D right here on the B string your middle finger here so this is a G chord and then you're gonna go like this hit your thumb down here on this on the low string and pick with these two fingers on the B and the G string and then hammer on to two right here so first get good at that and then you're gonna slap and when you slap your thumb needs to land right between these two strings it's important when you slap that it lands there. And I found if I, when I get going fast, sometimes it's it kind of, I don't do it like straight because it doesn't really work. I kind of get a little angle, but we want it ready to pick this string. So, so far you got. Make sure you can do that. Then after you do that, you're going to pick, lift this finger up and pick those two strings again. So you got. fingers, hammer on, slap, pick, then you hit the A string with your thumb. So there's the whole first part. Now what happens when you go faster, you start going like this. While you're switching chords, you're going to hit the A string, then the next part of the first little bit is you got to go to this chord. And this is a D major chord. You're going to pick these two strings like this. Then with your middle finger, hit the G string. So then you slap, just like we did before, landing on the A string. So it's going to be pinch, G string, slap, and then so the whole thing should be. Keep looping it. And it's tough to get it going fast. The next part is also hard when you first start doing it. It's really awkward. Put your middle finger right here on three, third finger on three. Now you gotta bar both of these notes. So three, three, barring these two. So make sure you can do this little shape. Now the first thing you do is put your pinky on three on the on four. That's the 4th fret on the G string, and go like this. So before you even move on, make sure you can do these fingers here, 3-3, three, three, bar, pinky on 4 on the G string, and just try this shape. Once you can do that, then what you want to do is just practice this. So it's like the shape, but you don't want to like let them all ring out. You just want to go. And I'm plucking all three fingers. I have three. I have this fingers on D, G, B. And then you're gonna go like this. This is where it gets hard. So you take your pinky off where it was on the fourth fret, and you gotta hammer on and pull off on here. So you notice I'm doing when, I, when I'm picking. I'm hitting A with the A string, and then the the next three strings up with these three fingers. So. I wish I could show my fingers better, but... So here we got so far, pinkies on four. Then you like this. Next part, you go. So you do the hammer on, but you don't do the pull off. So this is what I find trips people up the most.
It's like dong, pick, hammer on, dong, strum, just pick these three. No pinky. So far we got. Ah, sorry. And then the last thing is you gotta slap right here, landing so your thumb's below the D string. And then you hit the D string, but that note is being barred the whole time, so. So slap, hammer on. So, so far, the whole thing, actually, this is the whole thing. It's pretty hard. And after that, the next part, you do an E minor 7 chord. So the chords are going to be... So it's E minor with D with your pinky right here. So... Then you go to a D sus 2 with E in, with e in the bass. So it's going to be... This is cool. You do a G chord. And then you do, quickly, you put middle finger on two, first finger on one. Then you go to the C chord, three, two, zero, with third finger right there, and the open string on top. E minor seven. So that's the first thing. The next time you go um, E minor seven. You put your thumb on two right here, middle finger on two, so it's going to be D sus two on top. Put your thumb right here. Then you're going to go G with your third finger right here. So the chords here are going to be D sus two, a G with the hammer on thing, C add nine, E minor seven. Thumb here, D sus2 over F sharp. G, I'm only strumming up to here. And then you just do the chorus is just. So it's, that's D5, I'm not, I'm not strumming up to there. D5, A sus4, G, and I'm only strumming up to here. A sus4, E minor 7. You do it again, D, A sus4, G. Then you go to F major. So I'm doing it with my thumb because we got to pull lift this middle finger up. So you do F like this with thumb on 1, 3 on D, 2 on G one on B, and you're just going to do And there's a quick C. And the next time you go through, the next part after this, 